It is a success for the host today, based so far on shutting out the opposition. Well, defending is an art, and sometimes a forgotten one in this day and age, but this lot haven't forgotten it, that's for sure. Huddersfield Town have this team at their disposal today. Two banks of four, 4-4-2. Four, four, yeah, how it always used to be. Don't see it quite so often these days, but... Uh... And here's the shot. The possibilities... We're turning into probabilities as the move developed on that counter-attack and now they'll be reflecting on a genuine wasted chance attacking well here to put them in front a oh, great work by the keeper oh this is it he scored fantastic start really quick off the blocks here and they've given themselves a terrific boost for what lies ahead well, that's an awesome goal. Well, that's all about anticipation and just snapping up the rebound. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Got on the ball in midfield. Well read by the player in that part of the pitch. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Some good work by the medical team here to get this fella back onto the pitch. Yeah, I think he had the old magic sponge. And uh, he's okay now. Tried to tackle here, and he's done that. So for the home team, the chance for a league double here. But they had to work hard for the away win. And I'm sure the opposition will be doubly determined to stop it being a double over there yeah funnily enough it might not be as easy at home as it as it was away in that reverse game we'll see well they're in a good position here oh he's beaten his marker this might be it it's bounced back off the bar that's even better play to stop the chance they're cut out by the defender Space for the shot, and they have scored, and they do lead now by two, and they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match, we'll see. Well, we thought, Alan, we get a very tight game today, but I have to say, this team playing really, really well. Well, they are playing well, Martin, and uh, they're getting plenty of shots in on goal, aren't they? They've good value. Restarting at 2-0. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Good play, but they've locked. They'll get a free kick for that. Sean Scannell. Alonso. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Opportunity now. Well, he clears the danger. Alonso. Looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. He's got that well out of harm's way. Lerber. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Real chance. Struck the post here. Goal kick now. Alonso 
good position. They've worked this attack very well. Great chance. It's a tough ask for the visiting team today because the home side have won their last three matches. Well, and they're full of confidence and with the hope. Real opening now. It's bounced. Hit. Oh, it's in there. I think a manager loves that kind of goal because it was a real team effort the way they moved the ball about and once it came to the finish it was an unerring effort what a wonderful volley it's a wonderful ability to have isn't it to connect so sweetly it's all about timing that volley Alonso and in he goes with the tackle there's good progress with this attack out of danger there with that clearance and it's going to be a minimum of three minutes to be played about in time here's Draper and that's the referee the coach might have said well if they can do that in one half you can do it in the other half but it's going to take a lot of character for the losing side to fight back attacking well here that could open them up cross on and that will be offside flag went up Transfer news, and it's come from Manchester United. It's confirmed this deal is done. They are a club with deep pockets, and they've used those pockets to spend about £90 million pounds on what is a good player. Alonso. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Turn ball. Alonso. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. Good forward play from them. It could be a chance. Now it's a corner. Alonso. He's presented the ball to the opposition. There's some potential in this move. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. Good anticipation by the opposing player there to read the direction of the throw. Moving forward with some danger to the opposite. Wonderful chance! A well read by the goalkeeper. They do hate being chipped, keepers, don't they? They do, they do, and he did anticipate it and uh, collected it comfortably in the end. Well, he's pressed him there to running the ball out of play. Coming off the pitch, number 19, Luke Clayham, to be replaced by... Alonso. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. It was nicely worked until that point when it broke down. And now they've got to try and regain possession. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Good strong tackle. Trying to thread it through here. And the away team want to make a change. Substitution for Ipswich Town coming off the pitch. Number 10. Well, it's David got away from him. Coming onto the pitch. Alonso. Number 11, Brett Pittman. Here's a chance to attack. A real chance here. The team is lining up 
for the corner. It's 82 minutes played now. And they've cut it out. And the referee certainly not uh, flagging in his application of the law. Free kick. Aaron Moy. Attacking well here. Space to try and hit it now. And the keeper's pulled that one out of the bag. So the corner about to be taken. Please give a round of applause for today's man of the match, number two, Tommy Smith. It's great just to show you the fans who are in such fantastic form themselves today, like the team. Yeah, and uh, it has been a day of celebration. The team's played well, and the fans have played more than the part. In quickly. Final score, 3-0. Well, it turned out to be a different kind of game to the one perhaps we set up for you at the beginning. Very one-sided. Yeah, you end up feeling a bit disappointed as a neutral because we didn't really get a contest, but the winning team won't be disappointed at all. Played well. Well, they have had such a great defence, the home side, and they've added to that quality with some real attacking skill today. Yeah, they've just built it all together. And in this kind of form... They're going to be really hard to beat. To put them in front. A oh, great work by the keeper. Oh, this is it. English Football League Championship. Aston Villa 2, Preston North End 0. Barnsley 1, Leeds United 1. Blackburn Rovers 1, Birmingham City 1. Brighton and Hove Albion 0, Sheffield Wednesday 0. Cardiff City 4, Burton Albion 0. Derby County 2, Reading 1. Huddersfield Town 3, Ipswich Town 0. Newcastle United 2, Rotherham United 1. Norwich City 1, Wolverhampton Wanderers 1. Nottingham Forest 1, Bristol City 0. Wigan Athletic 1, Brentford 0. And let's take a look at what those results mean to the league table. At the top of the table remain Huddersfield Town with 76 points. In second, Newcastle United with 54 points.
Well, I know I'm looking forward to having a look at these two, Alan. Obviously, it's a team game, but they're intriguing individuals, aren't they? They are, and uh, they don't just play for themselves, which is the satisfying thing. They lift the head if there's a ball to be played, rather than shooting themselves. They will play that ball. Well, this is the Queen's Park Rangers lineup. Nader Manua has starts with Stephen Kolker in central defence, and at the point of attack, just one lone striker. He can put them in front. That's a fine strike but not quite what he was hoping for. But when he's hit it, I'm sure he would have thought that was going to bulge in the back of the net. Not quite, though. In quickly. Mackie. Alonso. Well, was good progress with this attack. Space for the shot. That's a good save, he got a touch to that. They've got a corner now. He went in well. Well, it was easy on the eye, but in the end pretty easy to defend against. Alonso. Mackie. Trying to switch on the attack. This is how they love to play on the break. Shot on! And the referee blows his whistle. The flag was up for offside. Sandra. It's gone out for a throw. Aaron Moy. Now he's looking for support. To take the lead. He's hit the frame of the goal. Sandro. Aaron Moy. There's been a bit of sorting out to do behind the scenes here at Loftus Road, the home of Queen's Park Rangers. Well, it's it's one of those grounds we always say is, is difficult to play at as a visitor, but perhaps it hasn't been as difficult as it should have been in recent seasons when they've been in the top flight. Nice bit of footwork. Real chance. Very cheeky in the circumstances. And goalkeepers hate being chipped. They do, don't they? I mean, he conveyed his thoughts, really, the lad trying to score. And the keeper read it quickly. And in he goes with the tackle. Well, they're in a good position here. And here comes the counter-attack. And now the shot. Gone for goal in spectacular style. Well, I was expecting him to be wheeling away in celebration there. Well read by the defender. Here's a chance to attack. Opportunity now. Fantastic save. Alonso. And that will be a free kick. Refs allowed them to take the quick free kick. Passed his man there. Whitehead. Good forward play from them. He can't put them in front. So close. The post. <laughs> Possibly a booking this. That is a terrific header. Unlucky, it's just off target. They generated some power on it, and the keeper wasn't getting there. Well, that is hard.
here we go for the second half of this Emirates FA Cup tie. Yeah, the first half wasn't bad. Hoping for more of the same here. Comes in with a tackle. Could be dangerous. Nader Manua. And there's the interception. Very straightforward save for the goalkeeper. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. To put them in front. Credit for taking on the shot. Well, what a good chance that was for him. By his standards, that's the glaring miss. His teammates will thank him for that. That's gone out for a throw in. Christopher Schindler. Well, they gave it straight to him, didn't they? Another turnover in play here with that interception. Sean Scannell. Attacking well here. Gets his foot in there. And the assistant signals for the throw. Poor throw, straight to the opposition. Spotted well by the defender, cut it out. And tackling, it's a real skill. Alonso, there's some potential in this move. It could be a chance. Well, it's a goal that's been on the cards. The better team at this stage of the match. And you wonder whether they would make that domination count. Well, they've done with this goal. Thoroughly deserved. They lead. In terms of shots, there is a real gap between these two sides. Reflecting some goal. But in terms of form, you'd have called it even, wouldn't you? Well, you would. And I'd like to see the stats at the end as to how many shots they are going to rack up. Because they've been peppering that goal. Well, that was the opening goal. We've had to wait to the second half to get it, but it's come now. Got the tackle in. Attacking now. The score! The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. Well read by the defender. Got past his man. Opportunity here! Goal! They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely, and that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. It's a great spell for this team. Two goals in rapid succession. The Football Association Challenge Cup. Arsenal 2, Middlesbrough 1. Birmingham City 2, Sunderland 2. Derby County 4, Gillingham 1. Ipswich Town 3, Shrewsbury Town 0. Leicester City 2, Brighton and Hove Albion 1. Liverpool 0, Hull City 0. Manchester City 3, AFC Wimbledon 0. Millwall, nil. Aston Villa, nil. Preston North End, two. Manchester United, one. Queen's Park Rangers, three. Huddersfield Town, two. Tottenham Hotspur, four. Sheffield Wednesday, one. Wigan Athletic, one. Everton, three. Wolverhampton Wanderers, one. Chelsea, one.
So the first half about to begin. How does Phil Town have this team at their disposal today? So, Alan, 4-4-2? Yeah, I think it looks that way, Martin. Yes, it's the conventional shape. It's the one that the manager prefers. Brighton will play with these players today. Two banks of four. 4-4-2. Four, four, yeah, how it always used to be. Saw the goal and went for it. Full on the frame of the goal. 